family and friends. We come together today to celebrate the love and commitment and friendship of two people who have decided on forever. Love is an amazing thing shared between two people. It is understood by all languages, by all religions, by all cultures. It can be spoken with or without words. Many of you here today have given Michael and Andrew support, warmth, and guidance in various stages of their lives, and they would like to extend their gratitude for that. The fact that you all travel here today to be with them is a testament to the love that you have for each of them. In 1 Corinthians chapter 13, verse 13, it says, Now faith, hope, and love abide. These three, but the greatest of all these is love. Genesis 2, verse 24 says, Therefore man shall leave his father and mother and hold fast to his wife, and they shall become one flesh. Ecclesiastes chapter 4, verse 9 says, Two are better than one, because they have a good return for their labor. If either of them falls down, one can help the other up. But pity anyone who falls and has no one to help them. Also, if two lie down together, they will keep warm. But how can one keep warm alive? Romance is fun, but true love is something far more, and it's your desire to love each other for your life, for the rest of your life, and that's why we're celebrating today. A good marriage must be created. Little things are the big things. It's never too old to hold hands. It's remembering to say I love you at least one time a day. It's never going to sleep back, standing together and facing the world. It's having the capacity to forgive and forget search for the good and the beautiful in each other. The most important 